Hi, good afternoon, and thank you for visiting AP Tech Tutorials. In this short video, I will show you how you can change the Windows uh, contrast theme uh, quickly and easy. So how do you get here? It's very straightforward. There's several ways to get there, but the easiest and fastest, all you need to do is right click on your, uh, on your uh, desktop and select personalized. Uh, if you don't want to go there and if you want to go through the settings, you'll find here, you click on start, you'll see the settings right here. If you don't see the setting right there, all you have to do is type settings and you will see it here. Anyway, um, so uh, right click on it, personalize, and then make sure personalization is selected here. Then select themes. After that, you will see here contrast themes, right? And here is a sample here on top, there are samples of how they're gonna look. Okay, aquatic, desert, dusk, or night sky. Okay. Now on this side here on the right, uh, you will see a drop down menu. You select, let's select aquatic just to, for to show it and make sure you click apply. Okay. It's gonna go to sleep a little bit. And this is how it's gonna look, okay? This is the theme. You see all my icon change, et cetera, et cetera. So I'm just gonna go back and, and change it back to uh, how it was before. So again, you go to themes, uh, you go to uh, contrast themes, and again, uh, drop down menu here. Uh, let's present another one, the desert one. Okay, click on apply. And this is how the desert will look. You see, very, very uh, light. So let's change it back to uh, normal. Click on personalize again. Um, and uh, again, click on themes, go back to uh, uh, contrasts. And then I'm just gonna say none, right? For, for now, just click apply. It'll take a few seconds and it'll, it'll go back to zero. But on here on top, you have an idea of how they look. Now, if you wanna change the, uh, the contrast themes uh, on and off, all you have to do is press out shift plus print screen these are three uh, uh, keys on your keyboard and you can turn it on and off but uh, as i said you can always do it manually here anyway um that's the end of it i hope you liked my video and if you did please give me a like and have yourself a great day thank you